Hi, I'm Ken with Prevectus Group, and welcome to part two of the Black Rifle series. So in part two of the Black Rifle series, we're going to talk about the loadout of the actual weapon system. Basically, what do I have on it and why? Um, been doing a lot of shooting with this uh, head down Prevectus PV-15. Got about a thousand rounds through it. Not one malfunction, not one anything. Uh, everything is functioning perfectly. Um, I really like this gun. It, it's, it's awesome. All right, so the first thing we're gonna start with is the Magpul Inbus uh, iron sights. I've got the rear sight and the front sight. You can activate it on the side here or on this side here. And all you're doing is pushing straight down, they pop up, or you can activate it by pushing down on the top. Most importantly, easy to sight in and they hold their zero very well. Some people don't like this, but I actually love it. Um, it's from Magpul, it's the ASAP plate or ambidextrous sling attachment point. I've been using this for a very long time. Since they've come out, I'm accustomed to them. I'm used to using them. That's why it's on this gun. So very, very happy with it. Next thing we're gonna move to is the Vortex 3 time magnifier. Uh, I believe it's the VMX 3T. Works very well. It does what it's supposed to do. And I like it because it's got this little throw feature you know, you can kind of get it out of the way, get up on your red dot when you don't need the magnifier. Um, if I can see my target better, I'm more accurate. So. Next is the Trijicon MRO red dot. This is the first time that I've run a Trijicon MRO. For the most part, I've only used aim point. I really like um, how it has a much larger field of view, field of view so I can see more of what I'm doing. Um, again, the better I can see my target, the better I can identify threats, the quicker I can get this dot on that threat, quick I can pull the trigger, stopping the threat. Um, the mount for the Trijicon is a BAD, uh, I believe it's uh, Battle Arms Development. Uh, it's a skeletonized um, uh, Trijicon mount. I like it, it's a third co-witness. So I'm able to uh, shoot through my red dot at all times, but if my red dot goes down when I pop up my sights, uh, I can just look through my iron sights, but it's, I'm also gonna be looking through the red dot as well so it's co-witnessed works great it's holding up pretty good i've been kind of banging this rifle around on purpose uh going through a lot of different drills and stuff like that and everything seems to be doing fairly well i'm also running this from magpuls the battery assist device uh, it does help you um, be a little bit faster when you're doing your reloads jam your mag in your support hand can then go and start to acquire the grip while your trigger finger is actually running the bolt back forward. So you can manipulate the bolt with your trigger finger. Um, I really like it. You're not having to come up here and hit the ping pong um, and all that kind of good stuff. Really like it, it works good. Okay, the next thing is from Bravo Company Manufacturing. It's the CAG or Kinesthetic Alignment Grip. Yeah, uh, mouthful, but works very, very well. But the biggest thing that I like about it is that it's just a stop. It just stops your hand. I really like that. I can get up on the gun it gives me a solid reference point of where my support hand needs to be every single time. It works very well. It's my first time using it and I'm impressed with it and I like it. The next thing is from Surefire. This is a Surefire M600V. Um, I think it's 600 lumens. Uh, don't quote me on that, just Google it. But really good light. The reason why I got the M600V in particular is because it does white light and it does infrared illumination. And if you look at the light, you can already tell, you know, it's taking a beating because it's right here next to the brake. And you can see the lens right there. You can see the side of it. You know, it's taking a beating. Um, and I'm gonna be honest with you, I, I really feel that the, if this was like an inferior light, uh, it wouldn't be able to take this for long, but it's taking a thousand rounds and I'm gonna continue to see how it does. The next thing I'm gonna talk to you about is from Steiner Optics. This is a, um, it has a visible green laser. It has an infrared laser pointer, which you have to use with night vision. Um, and it also has a infrared illuminator. Now I picked the D2 because the infrared illuminator has um, an option that I really, really like. 
uh, number one, it is super bright. And you can see this right here. You can adjust the focal point. You can make it where the illuminator is real tight um, and the focus point is real tight, or you can uh, adjust it out to where it's like a flood type light. The next thing that I put on uh, is also from uh, Surefire. It's the dual tape switch. What it allows me to do is it allows me to hit this button and I can activate the D-Ball D2, or I can come down to this switch and activate the uh, Surefire light. And the great thing about this is that my hand reference on the BCM CAG mount uh, or hand stop, I can get here, my finger, because of my grip, I use a C-clamp grip, I'm able to activate either one of them and I'm not even having to adjust my grip. So, so guys, that does it for part two of the Black Rifle. Stay tuned to part three, but just from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys so much for watching these videos. It means a lot to me. Um, as always, if you have any questions, put them down in the comments. As soon as I see it, uh, I'm gonna answer it. Um, if you like vi this video and you like videos like this, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. Now you can also find me on the interwebs at www.perfectusgroup.org. Also able to look at all the classes that we have for this year. We've got classes scheduled from now until November. So if you'd like to take a class, go check me out on the, on the, on the website, perfectusgroup.org. You can sign up and everything on there. Or you can find me on Facebook, forward slash perfectusgroup, on Instagram, at perfectusgroup. And guys, in all that you do, be unstoppable.